What is POEM procedure? POEM stands for Peroral Endoscopic Myotomy. POEM is a minimally invasive therapeutic endoscopic procedure to treat severe swallowing disorders by going through the mouth and treating certain esophageal disorders by cutting the muscles. This endosurgery technique is most commonly used for the treatment of achalasia cardia and spastic esophageal motility disorder. What are the esophageal motility disorders? Achalasia cardia. Achalasia cardia is a common motility disorder characterized by a high pressure of the lower esophageal sphincter where lower esophageal sphincter failed to relax and motility problem where movement of esophagus called as peristalsis is not functioning properly resulting difficulty in swallowing. The lower esophageal sphincter, less, it is the muscle that controls emptying of the esophagus into the stomach in patients with atlasia cardia, it is in tight spasm. This may result in dysphagia, unable to swallow food, leading to food regurgitation, heartburn, coughing at night, chest pain on and off, and weight loss. Spastic Esophageal Motility Disorder Spastic Esophageal Motility Disorder EMD, is a disorder that's characterized by uncoordinated contractions of the esophagus that can cause swallowing difficulties, muscles, spasms or regurgitation of the food back to mouth. There are different types of EMD such as diffuse esophageal spasm, nutcracker esophagus, and hypertensive lower esophageal sphincter. What is GPOM procedure? GPOM stands for Gastric Peroral Endoscopic Myotomy. Gastric POM is used for the treatment of refractory gastroparesis. This new technique is similar to POM procedure. Gastroparesis is a motility disorder that affects normal movement of the stomach muscles, resulting in improper emptying of the stomach. The actual cause of gastroparesis is not known, usually found in patients with diabetes complications or surgery or some medicine that can slow down the stomach emptying process. This may result in nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, bloating, weight loss, acid reflux, etc. What are the indications of POEM procedure? Patients those are having severe symptoms of swallowing difficulty that is affecting their quality of life, losing weight or not able to gain weight and having chronic acid reflux are significantly symptomatic and definitely they are eligible for the POEM procedure. Who all are the candidates of POEM procedure? Gastroenterologists select patients for POEM procedure after doing thorough physical and medical examination on the basis of the investigations such as Esophageal manometry X-ray barium swallow Upper GI endoscopy 24 hour pH metery How is the POEM procedure performed? During the procedure, the doctor passes a special endoscope through the mouth to reach the esophagus. An incision is made and fluid is injected in the internal lining of the esophagus. Tunnel is made in the esophageal wall, called as submucosal tunneling. Myotomy is performed where the muscular layer is cut on the side of the esophagus, the lower esophagus and upper side of the stomach. This will help in relaxing tightness and food is passed as normal to stomach and make esophagus empty as earlier. The esophageal incision will be closed with standard endoscopic clips. What are the benefits of POEM procedure? POEM procedure is new endoscopic technique and have better results than Helios myotomy, laparoscopic surgical procedure and balloon dilation with a high recurrence rate. 
There are many benefits of POEM procedure over surgery that includes Scarless endoscopic procedure Requires less sedation during procedure Shorter operative time Very minimal blood loss Shorter hospitalization Quicker recovery time Less risk of infection post procedure Effective in patients those previous surgeries were not successful What are the outcomes of POEM procedure Movement of esophagus called as peristalsis post procedure movement will come to its normal function and food is passed as normal to stomach and make esophagus empty as earlier Patients will take 10 to 12 days to recover and start normal diet.